My name is William Moore. I'm a master sergeant. I'm in the North Carolina Air National Guard Logistics Readiness Section. My job with them is the Equipment Management Specialist. I've been in the Air National Guard for 24 years. I manage over 100 accounts for the different squadrons here and at Stanley County and at the RTS. I found out back in October that the USO had come to Charlotte to the airport and I've been in the uh, military 24 years and have been to numerous airports and used several USOs and I knew what they were about so I thought this would be a good idea you know I could give back to the community and I went over there and joined as a uh, volunteer You have a customer at the baggage office, Continental Airlines baggage office. Please come to the baggage office. Thank you. What we do over there, we put out food for the troops to come through. We put out drinks. We have comfortable chairs for them to sit in. We have a big screen TV for them to watch, PlayStation games for them to play. We have books for them to read. Basically just a place to get into the quiet out of the airport and, you know, have a nice place to rest because some of them have, like, four, five, six hour layovers. It's a good place for them to hang out. The USO is the United Service Organization. It's an organization to help the troops. There's two parts to the USO. The USO that you know that Bob Hope used to go around and entertain the troops and then there's the USO here at the airport like I said that we do that. Being in the military I just felt like I needed to do something like this to uh, like I said give back to the military because they've given me so much and I just enjoy doing it. This particular thing I get a lot of satisfaction out of doing because, like I said, I'm getting back to the military. And I appreciate what the military has done for me. My name is Megan Grady. I'm the assistant director at the USO Charlotte Center. I am responsible for coordinating all the volunteer activities here at the center. Um, make them feel at home, really. I mean, that's the, that's the biggest thing is just to you know, make them feel comfortable. Whatever we can do to make our guests feel comfortable, that's what our volunteers do. Right now we've got about... 338 volunteers that come in and one of them is Master Sergeant William Moore and William's been with us since October of 2006 and has logged about 291 hours so he has been just a very big help to us here at the center. Um, our volunteers are very important. They basically run the center. Jack and I can't be here all the time so we rely on the volunteers to keep the center running. The reason I joined the uh, USO as a volunteer is because I've traveled a lot with the Air Guard and been to many of the USOs around the world. And when they opened this one, I just thought, hey, this is a good chance to give back some of that I've received in my uh, career. So I came over and they were pretty glad to have me. They said they were short on volunteers at that time. Now they got a lot. But it's, uh, it's been a real good experience and I, I really have enjoyed it. It's, it's just so much uh, joy and um, a feeling of accomplishment every night, you know, just to see those people come through. And it's just a really great feeling to uh, do my volunteer work at the USO. I take uh, great pride in the, in the work and expressions of appreciation that the uh, airmen, soldiers, and sailors express to us when they come through. And it's just it's a really great feeling. I find great pride in doing that because the people are so appreciative of what I do, what we do in at the USO, and they all say thank you and they just like shake your hand and it's it's just really uh, rewarding to uh, do it.